someone died put the body in the plane? Damn. <laughs> That's my fault for asking. Are you the guy that's also messaging my mother? Hey, show me your feet. I'm the young lady from Barcelona. What is your name? Julia. Julia, and what brings you to Bucharest? Job. Your job? What do you do for your trabajo? I'm a journalist. A journalist? What the fuck? <laughs> What are you reporting on in Romania? Okay, I was the less experienced, so they just uh, talk to me. They were like, yo, you go, you do Romania. You go talk to the Tate brothers. Yes, you go. Yeah. And what topics are you re reporting on here? Unfortunately, the Tate. Really? Oh my God. Wow, you can't make this shit up, yes? You are reporting on the Tate brothers. Yeah, Did you go to the compound? I got to ask him a question. Oh, what was the question? Why doesn't your hair grow? Or what was it? <laughs> No, when are you gonna be free? And he just looked at my legs. And he looked at your legs? <laughs> yeah. The Matrix. The Matrix doesn't want me to be free. Also, maybe uh, the fact that I did some bad things. <laughs> nice. Was he, was he relaxed at his compound? What's happening? Did you go to his house or you have to go to his house? You can't leave, right? I, I, I try not to go to his house. Very nice. So what's the, what's the latest updates on the Tate trial? They are chilling at home. They are chilling at home playing Counter-Strike? <laughs> They're playing a sex trafficker simulator? <laughs> There's a simulator for everything nowadays, okay? Very nice. Any other topics that you're covering here in Romania? What is there of interest? Well, the, the, the government. The government? Deficit. The which one? The refugees. The refugees. Deficit. The deficit. Oh, right? The bombs in the Black Sea. You know? The bombs in the Black Sea? Yeah. Which bombs? We have a lot, we have a lot of... Uh, we have a lot of literature about, bomb, about bombs in this country as well, okay? <laughs> yes, uh, we have this one piece of literature, it's called Yosun uh, Bomba Nucleara, which, uh, which is, of course, it's by, by one of the modern poets of Romania, okay? It's, uh, it's a song, it's, uh, it's uh, one of the songs in the Romanian repertoire, folklore, by one of our famous poets, Florin Salami. Uh, <laughs> Sir, what's your name? Do you consider yourself a talent? <laughs> what's your name? Pash. Pash? Yeah. Where are you from, Pash? Dubai. Dubai? Woo! Come, Habibi, come to Romania. You made it. <laughs> you know, everybody was calling you. You finally made it, yes? <laughs> Pash, what, what are you doing here from Dubai, sir? What brings you to Romania? My wife. Your wife, the uh, wonderful lady. What's your name? Clementina. Clementina? <laughs> <laughs> Ah, Florentina, sorry, my bad. <laughs> How the fuck did I mistake Florentina for Clementina? <laughs> nice, okay, so you have moved here from Dubai and you met uh, Florentina here, or did you guys meet in Dubai? How this? In Dubai, very nice, you went to Dubai, you checked it out. Did you live in Dubai for a while? Yeah, seven years. Seven years, wow, that's a lot. What is the biggest uh, cultural shock you had there? Nothing, it was all great. It was great? No problems. This show's recorded, okay? <laughs> then what do you do here, Pash? What, uh, how do you earn your pita? Or what is your... You're an engineer? What kind of? What do you build? Construction. Construction, real building, yes? You brought some of that Dubai engineering here. It doesn't work here. It doesn't work here, yes. We are. Yes, we have a saying in Romania. Până la Dumnezeu te mănâncă draci. That's a... Uh, that's what's happening. It's uh, in your case it would be the saying is until God uh, the devil is eat you. Yes, and uh, I think in the, the like the construction system here is uh, a little bit um, convoluted as well. Yes, sometimes the bags of cements they go missing or, <laughs> or what? very nice. Where are you for Florentina? Are you from Bucharest or? From Bucharest, yes. Uh, Bucharest is a nice place. I like it. I've been here a couple of times. Uh, my favorite place in Romania, of course, is still Vaslui, the RIP MVP. <laughs> But so far, you've been here for a couple of years. What's your favorite part about Romania, Pash? What's uh... Uh, people. The people? Which one? <laughs> her, her, first of all. Yeah. Very nice. And then you visited other parts of Romania. Where else did you go? I went to Sinaia, Hargita, Bran. Oh, you went to a little bit of traveling, yes? And who else do you have over here? Do we have more people from Dubai with you, or you don't know these people? Um, no, they're my friends. Your friends from Romania, yes? Uh, yeah. And did they? Did you take them to Dubai? Did you show them what's the what's? If we go to Dubai, there's a couple of be here, public couple of be here that might go to Dubai. Sir, you might want to go to Dubai at some point. What is there to do in Dubai? What's your favorite thing to do in Dubai? Me or them? Yours. Uh, You're the specialist. I know they what they want to do. Everything. Whatever you want. There's everything there. There's everything. Yeah. Everything. Everything. Gomorrea. <laughs> 
Where are you from, sir? Are you a Brosten boy? <laughs> Mikro Paispe boy, represent in the house. Very nice. And you've come here to, to study, to work with the gang, the boys, these your colleagues, your friends. Yeah. What do you guys do, boys? Krista, what do you? Airline representative. Airline representative? Which airline? <laughs> We will not say. We would like not to. Uh, we would like people not to spit on me. Okay. I, uh... No, I insist, please. That's Are you with Air Ryanair or? No. Huh? With? Qatar Airways. Qatar Airways. Oh, someone has the money. Yes. <laughs> Representing, you know, from Buzou to Qatar. Life is good. Yes. Start us from the bottom. <laughs> Made it to sometimes slavery. <laughs> this is the. <laughs> The Qatar Kuwait was with the with the problem. Yes. Okay. So you guys, so you're still serious. What's your name, bro? Dan. Dan. And you're also Qatar or? No, aviation. Bro. Aviation. Are you a pilot? Are you are you doing like what are you doing? Ground handling. Ground handling. Very nice. And uh, what is the? Do you get any weird stories with like with the aviation? Are people like canceling the the flights because they have diarrhea or like the pilot or what's the? <laughs> Do we have a lot of staff. Yeah. Yeah. What's the weirdest one? Come on, make it make it exciting for the people here. The craziest thing, somebody shot in a suitcase and packed it up. Uh, someone died and they put the body in the plane. After that, they died, they died mid-flight, they landed, they took the body and put it inside next the to the packages. Damn! <laughs> no, but that's my fault. That's my fault for asking, I gotta say. That's, uh... We, that's we have part. more if you want. We have you have more? So what, do they... Okay, let's go in there. Do they tie the head as well or does the head just do this during the flight or like... Safety first. Safety first, okay, yes, okay. Yeah, this guy, the Russian has a question about dead bodies. Yeah, of course. <laughs> The guy died in mid-flight. Yeah. Can I get his food? Yeah, who gets his food? Yeah, no, no, this is... Priorities, my name. Priority. <laughs> this is like weekend, weekend at Bernie's in Qatar. See, this is... Yeah. Okay, what was the other one? So this guy died, they put him, the, they put him with the dog in the, in the luggage hold. In the baggage hold, yeah. As a snack for the dogs. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Bibi died. Bibi, that was Bibi. Yeah, that, that was Bibi, yeah. That was Bibi, yeah. <laughs> Bibi couldn't take it anymore. Bibi was done with Romania, okay? <laughs> Motherfucking Bibi died and Iliescu is still alive, okay? <laughs> <laughs> nice, give me one more, let's do it. We got some good stuff here. Let's mine this, this, this gold mine. Um, at the flight, I won't say from where, a Brazilian guy that was a woman came in. <laughs> okay, a transgender person, yes? Uh, yeah. We don't, I, I, it hasn't invented in Romania yet. Okay. I, 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 I <laughs> that she yeah. or he was coming inside the country. Okay. The border police said, no, 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 Romania is not for you. And oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> and, and Romania has just gotten used to gay people, okay? Yeah. It's too... And uh, he or she, I don't know, okay. uh, got a little upset. And at that moment, when you get upset, if you think about it, your tummy hurts. And she or he took uh, her pants down. And whatever came outside of her went inside the tunnel. And we had to board passenger on that flight, if you remember. Damn, life is, uh, life is intense in the Mile High Club, yes? Yeah, trust me. Well, I hope, I hope... Uh, Thank you, my that was, uh, that was crazy. I, well, I hope, I hope they got a refund for the ticket flight, yes? No, this no, no, is... no, no, we had business, pla business class passengers boarding first, so no, it was okay. So I don't understand, they, 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 they took a poop in the plane or at the border? No, uh, uh, in the tunnel. <laughs> Everywhere. And oh, everywhere. in the tunnel. Yeah. yeah, everywhere. Yeah, everywhere. This is what happens. This is what happens when you don't recognize. She or he was very upset. Well, I can understand. Yes, Romania denied their existence. Yes. Exactly. Very nice. Well, round of applause for these guys over here. They give us some interesting stories. What about yourself, sir? White T-shirt. What's your name? Silvio. Silvio from. Bucharest, Romania. Bucharest, born here and bred. Yes. How bred? Boromir bred. Yes. This is. <laughs> You were born here, Sylvia. What do you do? What is your occupation? Marketing uh, manager. Chat GPT gone soon, okay? It's uh, <laughs> bye bye. And you're here with your friends, your lover? My wife. Your wife? Oh, congratulations. What's your name, the wife? Veronica. Veronica and Sylvia. How long have you guys been married for? 12 years. 12 years? Ay, ay, ay. Round of applause. Well done. 12 years of math. So Silvio, you've been together for 12 years at the moment, and uh, is it Violeta, was it? Veronica. Veronica, sorry, V, close. Dyslexia mentally as well, okay? It's uh, <laughs> nice, and uh, what do you do? I'm a legal 
Advisor. Legal advisor, any crimes you can advise against? <laughs> or pro. <laughs> What's the easiest crime to get away with in Romania? Clearly not human trafficking, Andrew Tate. <laughs> I don't know, maybe fast driving. Fast driving, okay, that you can get away with that one, very nice. And 12 years of relationship, uh, how, what's the secret, Silvio? <laughs> 11 years old daughter, that's the secret. I, uh, we are doing it for her. We are staying together for the young one, okay? We don't want her to end up like you. <laughs> Very nice. And how did you propose? What was the beautiful moment of proposal? Did you do something romantic? Like did you take her to church? Or did you take her to KFC? Or what was the... It was a quest. A quest? You gave her a quest? If you're gonna get married, find the ring. Go. 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 There's a time limit. You have 24 hours. If not, we're over. Okay, this is... What was the quest? She had to go to Transylvania and uh, reclaim Hargita, or what was the... <laughs> it was a very thoughtful quest. A thoughtful quest, okay. She had to go to different places, different homes, and find different things, and uh, clues to go to the other place, and so on. Okay, but like, did you tell her, if you'd finish this quest, you get married, or how do you even get... How did you convince somebody to go on this quest? I said it, she will find a surprise at the end. And what did you think the surprise was? Uh, I didn't know. You didn't know? You thought, well, maybe I'll get an iPad or something. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Instead, I, had a, I got a lifelong commitment and I lose half of my stuff if we get divorced. This is <laughs> very nice. And did you found it? What, where did you find it? Whose house was it at? In our house. Oh, she didn't really try that hard, okay? Uh, <laughs> you have to go to different houses. Our house, okay. <laughs> what other houses did you have to go to? Uh, in my uh, parents' house mm -hmm. and in my uh, brother's house. Ah, okay, okay. But then he was all always there, and he left little notes. Yes. Yes, yes. yes. Oh, no. And uh, and where was it hidden? Was it like hidden in the stove, in the bathroom, no. on the balcony? In Did the, the dog eat it, and you had to wait? <laughs> in the fish tank. In the fish tank. Yes. Oh, and you looked around there, and you're like, oh my god, it's a ring. And then he said yes. But then you said, now let's go, let's go get some refreshments because it's been a journey, yes? <laughs> That's very nice. Round of applause for them. That's very nice. Is anyone from outside of Romania dating a Romanian tonight? <laughs> yes, you guys over here, a young lady, you are the Romanian. Uh-huh. No, where are you from? I'm the Romanian. Ah, okay. Is the Romanian. I'm from Turkmenistan. You're from Turkmenistan, of course, yes. And you guys are not married yet, or? No. Not yet. Soon, maybe. No, no pressure, no pressure, no pressure, no pressure. <laughs> No pressure. Sorry, bro. Sorry. My bad. My bad. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Pray to Jesus. Opa. Nice. And you've come from Turkmenistan here to study or what brings you to the beautiful land of Romania? This West. <laughs> we are the West for Turkmenistan. Eh? <laughs> Mama, Dada, I'm moving to the West. You're going to France? No, I'm going to Bucharest. <laughs> okay. Basically, that was it. <laughs> to study. To study? Nice. And what did you study? Medicine. Medicine, very nice. And yourself, sir, are you also in the medical profile or what's your? Uh, law. Law, okay, law and you're like my, my mother's dream, you know, like this is. <laughs> very nice. So how long have you guys been together for at the moment? Two years, sir. Two years, okay. I said, how did you guys meet? Tinder, Bumble, was he? Facebook. Facebook? <laughs> are, you guys, are you guys, are you, are you the guy that's also messaging my mother? <laughs> You know, somebody like a lot of girls on Facebook, they get random messages for stranger. Hey, show me your feet. <laughs> you were on Facebook on one of the groups or what were you doing? How is it? Uh, she messaged me. You messaged him? Yeah. Nice, smart. you Romanian is Europe. Visa. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> smart, smart. Uh, you see? Uh -huh. We are desired product now. <laughs> Feels good, I gotta say, I gotta say. Some people were like, no, no, this is fetish, fetishization of the, of the I, I enjoy it, okay, more. Very nice, you messaged him, what was the reason for your message? I don't know, just random. Yeah. Just ran, you randomly messaged a guy on Facebook? Yeah, I was searching also. You were looking at pictures, mm, ugly, 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 oh. <laughs> Lawyer. <laughs> And were you surprised to get a message from somebody from Turkmenistan? Yep. Yep, I was like, whoa. 
Not losing my bank account again, no. It's crazy because you know, outside of Romania, they tell these jokes, but instead of Turkmenistan, it's Romania. <laughs> Very nice. And what was your reaction? Did you think it was a scam? Like, what the fuck? Yeah. What? Why? And you engaged, you didn't ignore. No. You were like, pussy is pussy, bro, okay? <laughs> <laughs> or what was your reaction? Okay. What the fuck? And then, who are you? Yes, who are you? And you explained, I am from Turkmenistan, I am here in the beautiful country of Romania to study medicine. You have external medical schools, very good things, and I am currently looking for friends. Is that what the conversation was? Somehow. We had a conversation about also surgery. I was surgery, talking about the formal. You, yes. This guy started asking questions to verify the information, okay? It was like, are you really studying medicine? Where is the appendicitis and how do you get it out, okay? How. He's doing due diligence, my man, over here, okay? Very nice. Well, Roger, of course, sir. Can you help your body, a body? How can I get rid of a body? Hi, that was a good question. Yes, you're, you're going in deeper. Okay, this is the lawyer stuff. It's like, how can I get rid of a body? I know how to solve the law, but how do I get acid? <laughs> Very nice. So round of applause for them, guys. Well done. We got a lot of people. And then we also have somebody from uh, Zurich, somebody from Switzerland. Where, where is the Switzerland person? Here. You're also part of the Spanish? Uh, yes, yeah, also a team from Bucharest. Travel for the wedding. Ah, you also traveled from, from, from Zurich or? Uh, yeah, from Zurich. Nice, very good. Welcome to Romania. Anything you need? <laughs> It'll be 55 euros, okay? I, uh, I think it's a good, that's a good deal. But what about the lady in the, uh, in the white shirt? What's your name, young lady? Yes. Moi? See? Si. What? Huh? Carmen. Carmen. And you are here with your friends, Carmen? Your... My fiance. Your fiance. Good job, bro. You put a ring, yes? What's your name? Nico. Nico? Niku she Carmen. Perfect. Very nice. How did you do it, Niku? How did you ask Carmen to be you the one? We went to London at the Big Ben? No, no, no. It was actually a restaurant. You went to the restaurant and you said, Carmen, looked into her eyes. I brought you all the way to London. You might have been suspecting it. <laughs> you might have her suspicions and I'm here to tell you that it's not a prank. How long, how long did you wait, Nico? How, how long? About four years or so. so there's a judgment here, okay? Uh, <laughs> is that too much? Do you think you waited too much or not enough? What do you think, young lady? If you don't know after four weeks. If you don't know after four weeks? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Don't let my her girlfriend hear this, okay? <laughs> so after four weeks, that's very strong. Did you guys know after four weeks? Four hours. Four hours? <laughs> Damn, he's like, I didn't know what she knew. <laughs> I had no idea, I still have no idea, but like, she won't take no for an answer, okay? This is... Nice, where are you from, are you from Dublin? No. Oh, okay, but so how did you end up in Dublin, sir? Oh, you guys moved there? Uh, yes. Okay, very nice. Are you Romanian? No. Nope. Dutch. Dutch, oh, very nice, good to have you here. We don't get a lot of Dutch people here. It's uh, ever since the, the Schengen rejection. That was Austria. No, no, it wasn't your fault. It was the Austrians. Don't worry. We remember. Yes, you guys are. We remember. It's the Austrians again. Yes, yes. World War II. Eh? But Carmen, tell us, what do you guys do? You guys got married. You said yes. Did you have any doubts? Did you? She was asking us now. Uh, I thought, I thought him that it's a lifetime engagement. And he was like, I am aware. You wanted to give him a, are you sure you know what you're doing? Is this was a conversation, yes? And you are, how did you guys meet? You went from meeting to marriage, where did you guys meet? On the street. On the street? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> no Tinder, no chat GPT. Some people use Bumble, they use Stumble. <laughs> like on the street where? This sounds dangerous. It was daytime. Daytime. Ah, okay, perfect. Daytime in Bucharest? No, in Galat. In Galat? <laughs> You, oh. you went to Galatz to get some? <laughs> Braila was not working for me, bro. I, uh, I was like, I'll buy one ticket to Galatz and first, but I, I get, try my luck, okay? And then you connected, you exchanged the addresses or phone numbers. But how did you even walk up to her? You're like, I'm not even from the city, but would you like to go on a date with me? I saw her. She was pretty. 
all the requirements met. <laughs> That's it, well done, Nadal. Well, round of applause for them as well, guys. Well done, we'll see, it's possible.